guys, today I'm doing a current household video in The Sims 2. I feel like I play a lot of Sims 2 offline, so I have a lot of different families to show you guys. But today we're going to talk about my newest addition to my world. Now, I've been slacking out with videos a little bit, just... Well, actually a lot. To be honest, um, I don't know if you guys have seen my latest video, but if you haven't, I'll have a clip right here somewhere on the screen. Um, so be sure to click that or check out the link in the description box below. I just took a little break and I also had to deal with some online harassment by a close, a close, I called it a close connection, which is like a, the most absurd thing I've probably ever said, but it was a friend of mine and now it's obviously not my friend anymore, but it was a friend of mine and who oh, Okay, hello kitty kitty. Uh, it was a friend of mine and I, you know, basically got harassed. Um, so I am going to introduce you to my latest, I'm just going to switch my cup with my hand, I know. It's really, really cold. I made myself some nice tea just to warm my hands up and you know, tea's good his life so yeah I had to have another cup of tea but basically I made um, a new family the a builders family now this family is literally like it was it started out as a joke into Cass and it turned out to be it turned out to be quite the intriguing quite the backstory for this family and I'll go ahead and talk about that um, in a second but first I want to tell you guys about the builders family so basically we have a dad and his daughter and three pets now it started out as a spin-off of Bob the Builder and I know it's like so random but me and Lexi were doing a live stream and we oh somebody peed okay all right the dog peed but it basically started out of a, as a joke between me and Lexi when we were doing um, a live stream like the day before yesterday and we were like, what are we going to do? So we decided that we were going to make the Builders family because why not? Let's make a spin-off of Bob the Builder. So we started making and I'm like, well, you know what? I'm going to make Bob the Builder like 2.0, you know what I mean? Like Bob is going to have a whole new, whole new Bob to, to the Bob. A whole new Bob to your Bob, all right? A Bob and Bob Bob is handsome y'all Bob uh, Bob is Bob is looking good I don't know if you can see much of Bob because he's quite sleeping right now but Bob has some jeans okay Bob has some good jeans there's Bob Bob is a little bit on the chubby side but Bob is still Bob is good okay Bob is life Bob looks amazing Bob this Bob is a bit like I said on the chubbier side than Bob the original builder um, this guy is not really a builder. This guy has hair. He actually has a face and actually has a nose. I know Bob has a nose. Um, I think he does. Does he? I think so. Anyway, this Bob is also a brunette and he has some green eyes and he's a bit more tan. And this Bob is a ladies man. You'll, you'll, you'll never find a man like Bob. This Bob is seriously a ladies man. Oh my god, does he love the ladies? Oh, there he is. Let me, let me show you Bob. Bob is, Bob is amazing, you guys. Let me quickly, let me give you a little, a little, <laughs> look at Bob. I'm sorry, but isn't Bob gorgeous? Bob, Bob, I was trying to, stay still for me, Bob, please, stay still for a second. I'm trying to show you, I'm trying to show them Bob. But yeah, there, there's Bob. Isn't Bob pretty? Bob looks good, okay? Now, there were all agreeing over the fact that Bob is actually pretty, pretty dumb cute. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? Well, Bob is gonna get a lot of ladies. Oh my god, I forgot the lamps. Um, well, I changed the lampshades. Let me talk about the backstory for Bob. So basically, Bob and his sis... Bob and his sister. No, that's not his sister. What am I saying? Bob and Wendy. Yes, it was a Wendy. Bob and Wendy basically got together for whatever reason. So Bob and Wendy eventually got a kid and Wendy dumped the kid on Bob and Bob was like, do I have to raise a kid? Because Bob is all about the one night stands, okay? Bob does not like commitment. Bob is a gold digger, you guys. You know why he's so rich? Because he's... Oh, can you hear that? The rain is ticking on my windows. Oh, caught me by surprise. It is shitty, shitty weather. Let me just say that. It's so shitty weather. I had to go to the hospital today. I literally was freezing my fingers turned blue walking and i'm like for 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 once in my life 
my makeup looks nice, my hair looks nice, and then it's like wind. Kane, Katrina, just pass by, okay? It's all about the ladies, but Bob does not like to have some commitments. Bob marries women and then he dumps them because he only wants their money and their booty. Basically, booty and money. That's what Bob is all about. And then he had to raise a kid which was like... Bob did not expect that, okay? Bob was like... What am I going to do? I'm gonna raise a kid and I still want to have the ladies. But it turned out to be actually a lot easier than he thought. Like, not saying that being a single parent wasn't hard for Bob, but it was definitely a lot easier than he expected it to because his daughter turned out to be a very, very relaxed and calm child, unlike my baby challenge kids who are like, like little devils. You know, his daughter turned out to be pretty fine and thanks to her calm, her calm nature and her ability to just adjust to, adjust herself to any kind of situation and to just entertain herself because Bob is, you know, Bob is out all the time. Bob only wants to go at the party and he didn't want to change his lifestyle though he had a kid he kind of had to try and you know change some things about himself so he could raise the kid but now that she's older he's like back into his old habits and you know she's fine with that she she's happy the way you know the way she is and oh my god you cat you cat are eating my food well then these cats by the way no no he wanted to have some entertainment for his kid while he was out he decided that he's going to adopt pets now you know bob isn't evil okay bob is just different bob wants women he marries them for their money takes their money dumps their asses because you know why because wendy dumped his ass wendy was the first woman he fell in love with but she was from the ghetto and you know what not everyone from the ghetto is as ratchet as wendy was but damn this wendy though this Wendy was a straight up punk, okay? And when she dumped him, he was like, I'm never ever ever going to marry someone else again. I'm just going to take their money and if I do marry them, just take their money and dump their asses. That's that's what Bob turned out to be like. So Bob is all about that money, all about that booty, party life, but no, he's not he's not about to have more kids or more commitments because Bob is done with that. But because he's still a nice person, Bob is not a monster. Bob decided that he's going to adopt all the pets that he can that are like not adoptable. So for example, these three pets are definitely not adoptable because they're all three aggressive and they do not like each other. So beyond the fact that they don't like, you know, people, they seemed, did I just say beyond the fact? What is that? You know, they don't really like each other. I'm just going to say that they don't really like each other. The cats fight, the dogs fight, but his daughter, his daughter Piltrate actually seems to be hanging out fine with the pets, which is, you know, good. Children are very good with pets and he kind of hoped that, you know, that would solve the issue of, you know, adopting pets that were like undoptable, but then not like be a danger to his kid. Like he doesn't want her, you know, her to be hurt, but... You know, he, he kind of adopted these pets knowingly nobody would ever adopt them, you know. So that's why he took them in, but I don't know, you got little ones of them. But adopted, who knows what could have happened with them, and this is exactly why Bob has them, um, you know, adopted them. So that's, 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 that's a real Bob, y'all. Are you peeing? Just peed. Oh my god, he just peed. Oh no, no he didn't. He's falling the base. What am I saying? No. This floor is... Um, the bedrooms and a bathroom and a desk uh, area for Bob and then we have you know a table um, a basically a kitchen and a little bit of living room downstairs with a hot tub and our barbecue and then little the little pets have a house outside and there's a car so basically that is all there is to this house they're obviously gonna expand but Bob didn't really want a big house he just wanted a house for his kid um, which you know it's why he moved to a whole different town. He doesn't know all the women here and he kind of has a bad reputation where he came from. Where he came from. So, um, he definitely wanted to have a fresh start in a new world. And I mean, I, I like this house. This house is not ugly, okay? This house is kind of cute. It's, you know, perhaps not, um, 
ideally, but it's a temporary solution until I download a better house or build one, but I'd rather download one because I feel like I download houses better than I build them. That's just a fact. And I have to accept that. Yeah, Pilotrud is a very good with animals, as you can see. And she doesn't have many friends. She doesn't really know anyone here. But she's, you know, close friends with the pets and she's very happy to just be alone with the pets. She's she's quite outgoing. I guess she got that from her dad. Um, she's not very lazy. She's kind of in the middle and she's a very, very serious person. Um, and she's also very nice. A little bit sloppy, but you know, her dad is kind of sloppy too. Um, so he is very sloppy, very outgoing. He's, you know, kind of lazy and active, but he'd rather not be active. He just likes to party and then he likes to sleep. For the rest of the day um he's quite you know in the middle of being serious and playful and he's more to the nice side than being grouchy but he's a little he's a little bit chubby though but that's what you got if you don't do nothing and you know he doesn't want to do anything he just wants to sit there and play games all day now he's playing at his daughter's computer while he has his own you know what dude you have your own computer let's go for here and have you play the same game with that on your own computer so yeah, that is what's going on with this family. Like uh, seriously, I was laughing so hard when I was making these, uh, when I was making Bob because Bob though, you don't expect the Bob to find a Bob like this. Like Bobs have a bad reputation, especially if you're gonna copy a children's series. Yes, that Bob can never become great. But hey, I did it. I have created the Bob, the Bob that will change the reputation of Bobs all over the world. So Bob is basically, he has met some new girls, he has, um, he's come in contact with Gretchen and Lily and, um, Nerissa and Lila. And these are not sims that I made, these are just townies basically. Eventually, story-wise, I would love for him to actually get in contact with, um, with only those who are in town, but obviously while I'm still building and trying to develop storylines, that is not going to work out. But I have some mods which basically unties the connection with certain sims. If you don't want to have, for example, you want to, I don't know, so let's, let's say you don't want Pilchard and Bob to be related. All you do is untie the connections and there you go. It's like uh, a data or a d beta, beta data, I think it's beta beta version of you know the world that I actually want um, this is all you know I did decorate it the way I wanted to but it's still kind of like beta like I said beta oh there's a lot of a lot of fog going on right there but yeah that's a little bit about the world um let's go ahead and get back to Bob and his family oh I see that Bob has invited a lady over now he does not discriminate between Gen well, he does discriminate between gender because he's only attracted to females, but age is not a thing to him, okay? Age is definitely not important to him, and obviously, this this lady looks good, okay? She still looks furry, furry good. Look at her face. Look at her. She is quite pretty, and you know what? Why not? She might have a lot of money, so we're gonna admire her and see what she's up to. And then we have Pilotred. Pilotred is just taking a nap. She's just very, very tired. I mean, it would be nice for her to have um, more friends, but really, you know, she's not gonna find much friends on the first day after moving. She's been here like a week or two, but you know, you're not gonna make much friends in a week or two unless you go out and a daddy doesn't take her out unless he goes out partying like he's not a perfect dad I'm not saying he's perfect but you know he, he he could improve himself in some aspects like taking her out for a play or whatever but she's quite content with her pets for now and he's not abusing her or neglecting her he's just not a perfect you know perfect dad but who is a perfect dad? And it's his first kid and he has no ones for children. Like, it's a blessing he even managed to raise a like, as well as he did. Why don't we have a little party and send out a lot of girls? Oh, have a lot of girls coming. Can we do that? I think if we throw, I think we can throw a party. New Year's bash. House party sports. Let's do a house party. So we're going to invite a lot of girls over and I hope all the girls are going to come because I know it's, it sometimes happens we don't know the person that well, then nobody's gonna show up and it's kind of sad, but that's just how it is. We're gonna have you, lady, take, uh, not take, but change in, oh, okay. Let's just invite them all over. No, 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 we're not gonna invite, where's Cole? Cole, you cannot come. We don't We don't do Coles, okay? We don't do goals. Nothing is gonna go in Cole. These nuts. Bob is going to change into his formal wear. 
because you gotta look good, okay? Bob's gotta look good. Hopefully, someone is going to show up. I know not everyone shows up when you know you don't know them, but oh, hello, Narissa's down. See, Narissa is Narissa is down, okay? Narissa doesn't care how long you've known her for or how long she's known you for. She's down, okay? She's down for for every for anything. Hello, let's go ahead and. Basically, let's appreciate her and admire her. Um, what are you gonna do? I think you should go and take the dog for a walk. I don't think you should be here while daddy's gonna try and hook up with a lot of girls. Why is everyone getting along with my pets but me? That's just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just sad. Stop, stop ruining my couches. I had to get a new couch twice now. What are you doing? Are you literally trying to trying to figure out a Rubik's cube while my party is going, girl? That's a party pooper action. Like who's who in their right minds would solve a Rubik's cube on a party? I can't even get that thing done in ten years in my spare time. Good. Okay, this Bob looks good. This is one of my Sims where I first like when I made him, I was like. I have such a perfect storyline for you. It's all working out quite well. Unfortunately, they don't really progress on their own like The Sims 4, which is kind of sad because, you know, would have loved that, but we can't have everything we have. And don't you dare destroy this couch because I'm thinking a third one again. Let's go ahead and appreciate her. And let's see, ask. I kind of want to have him, you know, get that booty tonight, but I don't know if that's, if, if it's in, you know. Um, so let's ask, what's her sign? Um, let's ask her turns on and let's go ahead and ask um, do you like what you see girl what the what have we done wrong now you know for a ladies man he's not doing so well hey baby so today I actually did quite a discovery I was trying to tie my hair up I was trying to do like a half knot um, and like half hair down that was smooth, but that was what that was what I was trying to do, and I lift up my hair from the bottom, like so you can see, you know, the the, the hairs on the back of your neck, like down on the neck and your neck, basically. And I I look I look in the mirror, right? I was holding my pocket mirror so I could you know do my makeup the one like magnifies. So I had that one in my hand, and I have a mirror, like a big mirror, um, in front of my bed. So I. I know I have one to look I <laughs> I have the one pocket mirror in my hand while I'm facing my back to my mirror so I can look at my you know at the back of my neck right don't know why I was doing that but hey ho I was doing that all of a sudden I noticed I have the biggest freaking wait what is that like it's either a birthmark or a wine mark like thinking to myself while I was seeing that I'll have a picture included here like what is that like how did I get that like how since when do I have this and I think you know I've probably had it for like a long time but you know when you're not like when something is part of you you really just don't even realize it anymore like you don't realize that you know there is something in the back of your neck like a really long birthmark like if someone were to ask of it I was like hmm? I guess she's not into us which is stupid because like look at us look at us I think I've got the perfect picture. Probably not. I don't know. It's, it's really hard to take good pictures in Sims 2 for like thumbnails, but you know, I think this will work. I don't know. Kind of. Whatever. I'm just gonna take it anyway. There we go. There we go. Alright. So it's definitely not working out between him and Arissa, but you know what? Let's just say goodbye to her. Anyone? Everyone? What do you mean everyone? There's nobody here. Unless she's in our- Oh, she's still here! Poor girl! Oh, poor- Ooh! Okay, so perhaps we can get some booty from Krista. You think Krista might appreciate us? Let's ask her if she likes what she sees. I have a feeling she might, but hey, we have to ask her first. We have to be polite. We can be polite if we want to. Not every time. Every time for time, but we could. We, 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 we quite, we quite polite. Oh. Why are you getting rejected? Okay, let's do a wall whistle. She's like, I'm kind of attracted to gray hair, so basically she's just telling him politely that he is not her type. <sighs> Sorry, dude, it's just not, not your day. Why don't you get a bag of crisps and just, 
eat your sorrows away, you know, you just just do that. Up, dude. This party sucks. At least we're still cute. Cute. They're both like they're they're older, you know, they're older, so they might die soon, but whatever. You could just look at his face like, why do I need to clean all of that up? Well, you did it yourself, son. I think the dogs try. Who who try try for puppies with who? Who's Baron? Wait, what? What what what? Let's check our relationships. I do not see a Baxton. Ooh, m moody. Um, where's the dog now? Where is where is he at? Tawny the cat. That's what you're doing. But I want him to go ahead and try for Poppy to pair. <laughs> like I don't think she's. Ooh, can I make the dog selectable? Ooh, I want. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Green Baron. That's Green Baron though. I we I I wonder if we can. Like have werewolf puppies. Wouldn't that be cool? If we had werewolf puppies. That'd be cool. I know for a fact that we get friendly with Baron. We can become a werewolf. Wouldn't be cool? If we had like werewolf puppies. Why are you crying? Literally, one woman does not like him, and he's already crying. What? What's wrong with you? I think he's leaving though. Uh, that's sad. That's sad, but that's life. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this current household video. Let me know if you want me to be playing or do updates more often with some of these Sims on this world. Most of my live streams will be from The Sims 2 because I will be playing with these families. I just like playing with them. I feel like it's just a lot of different families to play with, so there's always something going on. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.